<laughs> Halloween is still more than a month away, but Middle Tennesseans are seeing a trend in people wearing clown masks to scare other people. Even though some masked men may not have bad intentions, authorities say wearing a clown mask in public is no laughing matter. We realize it's just a prank, but I, I think the social media has driven it to a point it's, it's gotten out of irresponsible. Someone's going to get hurt. While some law enforcement and neighbors are concerned about these masks, here at Performance Studios, they're driving sales. And over the weekend, we did see an increase in clown costumes, uh, clown mask. I do think, though, it's because it just sort of made it popular for just a second and it's sort of trendy for just a second. For some Halloween lovers, the frequency of creepy clown encounters has led them to rethink their plans. Well, the only thing I would say that has sort of concerned me a little bit is I, I'm involved with a yard hunt and one of our themes this year, before we decided, before any of this stuff ever came about, we decided it was going to be kind of a circus clown theme. The thought about being a clown for a costume contest we were going to this year, but probably not now because of all the clown stuff, because <laughs> I don't want to be walking around like going to a costume contest and get arrested for being dressed as a clown, you know. It's definitely not a wise decision in any way, probably to be a clown for a while, you know. And to those who have bought scary clown masks recently, Gary Broderick gives stern advice. Don't get shot and don't get arrested with these clown masks on. In Nashville, Grant Robinson, News 2.